Hello everyone, welcome to Spiritual Butterfly. Today I will be doing a love reading for Aquarius. So we're going to do a pick a card style. I have two groups. This is group A, this is group B. Aquarius, so far you're the only one that got two hearts for both piles. Um, remember that these messages that I put forth, they are general. They will not resonate with everyone. Just take what does, apply it, aquas, and leave the rest. Also, like the video, subscribe to the channel, and click that notification bell, okay, in order to receive notifications when I post. So let's get right into this reading. I'm going to give you a few moments to ground your energy, see which pile is speaking to you the most, and then we're going to get into it. Okay, Aqua, so let's jump on board. We're starting with group A. So let's flip over the cards and see what messages are waiting. It says time. You're trying too hard. Give it time. Okay. I heard fix it. Some of you are trying hard when it comes to trying to fix the relationship, a connection. I heard let it go. Just let it be what it's going to be. Don't try to force anything, Aquarius. Whatever is meant to happen is going to happen. You don't have to force yourself to be in anyone's life. You don't have to force a relationship to come together. You don't have to force anything. Just allow it to be. Allow things to happen gradually. And whatever is meant for you is for you. The next message that I have is my beloved. Though we may be physically apart again. <laughs> <laughs> do not try to force anything this message is for those of you who may be in separation it says spiritually we are always united for love transcends space and time nothing is missing yes so even though you're not together you and this person still share a deep bond you still have a lot of love for each other and it's saying that even though you may not be together it doesn't take away from you know, the feelings that you have for each other. It doesn't take away from the experience that you have shared. Nothing is missing. Nothing is lost, Aquarius. So let's pull some more messages to go a little bit deeper. Spirit, tell me more about time. Messages for time. Okay. I have mature woman... Drake, worst behavior, the part where he says, I've grown up. For some of you, you may not get back together with this person until you're older. Some years may pass before you actually come back together. For someone, there's a need for this person or for you or possibly both of you to just mature. There's... Some maturity that needs to take place, some growth that needs to take place before you come back together. And for some, this is not going to be until you are much older. I heard married. And I heard again. For some of you, like, you may end up getting married to someone else, having a family with someone else, and coming back later in life, like way later in life. We're talking about, I heard 40s and 50s for some of you. I heard like a long lost love. Yeah, even though you can't be with this person right now, like you'll never stop loving them. And I do see for some of you getting, you're going to get back with together with this person, but it's going to be a long time from now. Let's get a message for my beloved. I have official person and I have concern. I heard grew apart. 
for some of you like you and this person you just have grown apart from each other like you've changed like just time and space has changed you um you're both headed in different directions i also see someone's family member possibly a father figure being concerned over who they're in a relationship with or who they're possibly going to be getting married to. I heard engaged. So you're engaged to this person and your family is concerned about you marrying them. I heard like they don't agree. They don't agree with your choice when it comes to a mate. So let's pull some more messages to go a little deeper. Spirit, give me a message for a mature woman. I have retreat. It's time to disconnect from the world. Yes. Some of you, you just need some time to yourself. You need some time to yourself, some time to heal, some time to grow before you and this person can be together. Retreat. I feel like with retreat, this is just you needing time alone. And again, I heard separation. Let's get a message for official person. I have free yourself. It's time to take back control over your life. I heard don't do it. If you're marrying someone or you are planning a wedding, I heard like don't do it. There's a lot of things that you don't really know about this person. I heard like that hasn't been revealed to you and like your family isn't really on board with this relationship. I heard like run. Aquarius, you need to run. You need to get away from this person. Yeah. I heard a wolf in sheep clothing. Yeah, this person is hiding something. They're not being authentic. They're not being genuine. You need to run as fast as you can. Spirit, tell me about concern. I have honeymoon. Enjoy the bliss of holiday time together. Yeah, this person has met your family and your family does not like this person. I heard used for some of you, your family feel like this person is using you. I feel like for someone, you may elope. You may actually elope with this person. Your family feel like this is just a phase with this honeymoon. Like this isn't somebody who you really just need to be serious with. They feel like you're going through a phase and they don't want you to make a decision that you will regret in the long run, Aquarius. So let's go a little bit deeper. Spirit, tell me about retreat. I have proposal in the reverse. Yeah, you've called things off with this person. You have called things off with this person. You backed away from this relationship. And for some of you, you're just choosing to just focus on yourself at this time. Let's get a message for free yourself. excitement in the reverse I heard make it last forever this feeling that you feel when it comes to this relationship it's it's not going to last 
this is a seasonal situation. This is not meant to last. Um, I heard karmic for some of you. Like this is a karmic relationship. This person is in your life to teach you something. This is not going to be a long lasting connection. I feel like this person is pretending. This person is hiding a lot. I don't see you being happy in the end, Aquarius. If you move forward with this relationship. Let's clarify excitement. Yeah, I have intimacy. For some of you, the only reason why you feel the way you do is because of the physical intimacy. It's because of the sex. Point blank. And it's like clouding your judgment when it comes to making the best decision regarding this relationship. Spirit, tell me more. Let's get a message for intimacy. I have breakup in the reverse. I heard I'm still holding on. For some of you, that's what's keeping you in this relationship. The physical intimacy. That's why you're not letting go. I heard I'm sprung by T-Pain. Yes, Aquarius, you are sprung. You are, do not want to let this person go. You do not want to walk away. Spirit, give me a message for Honeymoon. I have clarity in the reverse and I have jealousy. Yeah, things are going to change between you and this person. Like right now, they're acting all sweet and genuine. Like they really love you. Like they're a very good person. They're nice. They're trying to pretty much show you the time of your life, Aquarius. But things are going to change. Your family is right. Our intuition. You need to really pay attention to your intuition. This person has control issues or is very manipulative. For some of you, this person may even be abusive. I heard like stalker for some of you. That you it may be hard for you to get rid of this person. I heard like ruin your life. Like this person may stalk you. Like you may not be able to fully move on. Cause it's like wherever you go, there this person will be. They have control issues. It's going to be hard for you to get rid of this person. And I feel like with clarity and the reverse, like there's something that you don't see. Like you're blinded by the physical intimacy. It's blocking your judgment, but this person is not good. They do not have good intentions. Like even with this darkness, like they're hiding in the dark. There's something they're not telling you. I also heard mental health. For some of you, this person could have mental health issues that you don't know about. But yes. And I heard like past girlfriends, for some of you, this is not the first time. This person has done this before in other relationships. They pretended to be someone that they're not. And by the time their ex found out about it, it was too late. Yeah, you really need to, I heard like protect yourself. Yeah, you need to be on guard with this person because they are not, they don't have all the screws, the tight ends. Aquarius. So let's pull some overall advice. Spirit, what overall advice do you have for Aquarius? I have the Seven of Pentacles. I heard be careful who you invest in, like, be careful who you give to. But because I heard like waste of time, like you don't want to be in a situation where you feel like you wasted your time. So be careful what you give to who you give your energy to. Let's get some more messages. Yeah, but this jealousy, this person is not a good person. I have Hermit. Let's get one more message. And I have the Knight of Pentacles. I heard wait. Some of you, you just need to wait. 
don't rush into anything hermit energy you just need to take time for yourself go in do some reflection again going back to this first heart this is going to be a season where you're just working on yourself during this separation growing maturing learning more about life and then you and this person will get back together later once you have come more into yourself once you understand more about you I also heard nothing was wasted. For some of you, you may feel like you did waste your time investing and you didn't reap the harvest that you wanted to reap when it came to a relationship. But Spirit is saying nothing is wasted. It's all for your growth. Understand that everything that you're going through, Aquarius, is making you wiser. Hermit energy is making you wiser. It's like, take your time. Don't try to rush. For those of you who... Are looking at this relationship through rose-colored glasses. Take your time with this person. It's something that you don't see. It will come out. Do not rush into anything. I heard fast moving. This person likes to move fast in relationships. They like to rush things. So be very careful. Take your time. Do not rush into anything. So group A, these are your messages. I hope they resonate. Stay true to thyself and real with thyself. Grow with me as I grow with you. Everyone stay blessed. Hello, group B. So we are going to jump into your reading and see what is your current love situation. So the first heart says, if you could do anything, what would it be? The answer dwells in your heart, not your mind, for the heart is the gateway to the soul. So if you could do anything, if you could have anything, group B, what would it be? Spirit is here to let you know that you can have it. You can have that relationship. You can have that love of a lifetime. You're not asking for too much. It is yours if you believe that it can be. This message is also saying to follow your heart. Whatever choice, decision that you feel like you need to make, follow your heart. Go with your instincts. Do what feels right for you. The next message is, wait, don't rush into it. Allow nature to take its course. So yeah, don't try to move too fast. Let things happen at its own pace. I had a similar message for group A, so you might have been drawn to both piles. For some of you, you may want to go back and listen to group A's message. But yes, don't rush into it. Give it time. Get to know this person. Make sure that they're the right one for you. So let's pull some more messages to go a little bit deeper. Spirit, give me some more messages for group B. Messages for group B. Okay, I have three messages. I have despair, I have imprisonment, and I have wealthy man. I'm getting two messages. The first message is some of you feel trapped when it comes to a relationship. You feel like you're stuck. Like, I heard, like, no way out. For others of you, like, there is someone waiting for someone to get out of jail or get out of prison. But you're already seeing somebody else. Like, you're dating someone else. <laughs> and you are really interested in this person. Like, they're very different. You may have been drawn, like, to bad boys or bad girls. But it's like you're changing your perception when it comes to relationships and you want more for yourself. And this person, like they're offering you that. They're offering you more. They're showing you a different side of life, a different side of relationships, of love. So let's get a message for weight.
you feel stuck for some of you you feel like i heard like you owe you feel like you owe this person um you feel like you want to be faithful you want to be supportive but at the same time you have somebody here who who's interested and you're interested as well so it's like with despair it's like you don't know what to do do you continue to wait it out or do you move on with your life Got her. I'm locked up. They won't let me out. <laughs> I forgot who sings that song. Akon. There it is. Akon. They're not going to be letting your person out anytime soon, Aquarius. Look at what I have concern. Yes, some of you may have been drawn to group A. You have family members, friends who may be concerned about you rushing into a relationship. They don't like this person. They feel like something's off. Yeah, they're concerned that you're moving too fast. Let's pull some more messages. Spirit, tell me about despair. Jealousy. This person who's locked up may feel like you already seeing somebody else. They are they may know that you're already talking to someone else. And I heard question, they may have already questioned you about it, Aquarius. For others of you who feel like you're trapped in a relationship, this person has jealousy issues. Yeah, they're very controlling. Like I heard your every move, like they want to watch your every move. I also heard dress for some of you. This person may also tell you how to dress. Yeah, you feel stuck. You're not happy. Let's get a message for imprisonment. I have healing. For some of you, I feel like you're healing from a toxic relationship. I heard abuse, so there may have been abuse when it came to this connection. Let's clarify. Spirit, let's clarify jealousy. And then we will clarify healing. Spirit, clarify jealousy. Redemption. In the reverse. Yeah, this person has, I heard like despicable. Bugs Bunny, despicable. <laughs> That's what Spirit just gave me. Yeah, this person is, this is not a good person. I heard toxic. Yeah, this is a very toxic relationship for some of you. I heard back and forth. There's all our back and forth. I heard violence too. For like someone, you're in a very violent relationship. Spirit, tell me about healing. Or you were in a very violent relationship. I have celebration. Some of you are happy that I heard like let go. <laughs> Some of you are happy that you don't have to deal with this person. For some of you, this person is in jail or in prison. Because of what they've done to you. This person may have harmed you in some way. And they're locked up because of that. And you feel free. You finally feel free. And now you can move on with your life. Let's get a message for a wealthy man. Again, 
Kanye, um, I was going to say Kanye West, Akon, I'm locked up, they won't let me out. This person is not getting out for a very long time. Whatever they did, whether it's something that's related to you or not Aquarius, they're not getting out for a very long time. I have unexpected wealthy man. Yeah, there's somebody coming in and yes, this one is a banger. <laughs> <laughs> this person have it together yeah you're not expecting this like they have it together they're very financially stable and i heard take care of you aquarius this person is going to want to take care of you i heard like night and day yeah this person is very different from your past relationship or this person who's currently locked up for some of you you're waiting on this person to get out but this man or woman for some of you like they're going to come into your life and this relationship is going to be so beneficial to you it's going to make you so happy that i feel like i heard the wait is over like you're going to stop waiting on this person let's get a message for unexpected I have conflict and I have life partner. This is going to be a very peaceful relationship. This relationship is going to be very different for someone you've been through a very toxic connection. I heard like abuse, like you've been through abuse and this person is like going to be a complete turnaround from what you have experienced. It's going to be a very peaceful connection. This is going to be somebody that wants to give to you, that wants to invest. Life partner, this is going to be someone that you can settle down with. Spirit says you deserve this Aquarius. You are worth it. You may have not felt like you were worth it. This person may have made you feel like you wasn't worth it. This past person that you were not deserving of love. But Spirit is bringing someone in your life that's going to show you that, yes, you deserve love. And not only do you deserve love, Aquarius, you can have it. You can have what you deserve. You can have what you want. For some of you, you have a choice to make, Spirit says, between this person who's locked up and they're not going to let out anytime soon or this new person. Two different lives, two different lifestyles. That's what you're choosing between, two different lifestyles. What do you want for yourself? What do you want for your future? What do you feel you deserve? Let's get a message for concern. Yeah, I keep hearing that Akon song. I'm locked up, they won't let me out. <laughs> Somebody person is not getting out for a very long time. Yeah, I heard a bid. I heard 10 plus for somebody. I have excitement. They know that this is not going to last forever. Like your family, your friends know that. I heard pretending. This person is pretending. If you pick this pile and this message resonates, you need to go watch pile a but yes your family they know that this person is up to no good that they're being a phony that you're not going to be happy for long their true colors are going to come out eventually aquarius let's get a message for excitement I have extroverted. 
I feel like for some of you, this person is going to, I heard cut ties. This person is going to try to cut you off from your family and your friends. They're going to try to cut you off from your family and your friends. They're going to try to change you as a person. I heard fear, like you're going to live in fear. You're going to feel like you can't say anything. Again, I heard dress. For some of you, this person may try to control the way that you dress, um, where you go. You're going to, I heard like trap. You're going to feel trapped when it comes to this connection. You're going to change. If you stay with this person, you're going to change. They're going to change you. And it's not going to be for the better. Let's get a message for extroverted. I have promised in the reverse. Yeah, whatever this person is telling you is a lie. It's a lie, Aquarius. <laughs> they are lying to you. They're not being honest. This person is not being genuine. You need to be careful. Do not rush into anything with this person. Yes, I heard. Look out. Watch your back. Yes, do not rush. Look out for deception because this person is not being honest. So let's pull some overall advice. Spirit, give me some overall advice for group B. Overall advice for group B. I have the page of wands. Out with the old and with the new. I heard like, what you waiting for? <laughs> like, what are you waiting for? Somebody ancestor just said that. What are you waiting for? I heard grandmother. This is somebody's grandmother saying this. What are you waiting for? Let's get some more messages. And then she said, honey, don't be a fool. She said, what are you waiting for? Honey, don't be a fool. Let's get some more messages. I have the Six of Swords in the reverse. I have the Page of Swords in the reverse. For some of you, you just need to start making better judgments when it comes to your love life, your relationships. Yeah, you need to start making better judgment. But this Six of Swords in the reverse is like you're still holding on to something that you just need to let go of. Yeah. I heard they're not coming back. For someone, you may be waiting on a past person to return, to reconcile with someone. Spirit says this person is not coming back. I heard like no do-over. Yeah, this person isn't coming back. It's just time for you to move on. To move on with your life. For others of you with this page of swords in the reverse, I heard like cut off. Yeah, you need to cut off communication with this person. You need to cut this person off completely. For those of you where this person is lying to you. And they're not being true. They're not being real with you. And if you don't cut things off, you're going to find out the hard way. It's time for you to move on. Have a new start. Have a new beginning with someone else. Whether this is about you waiting on someone to get out of jail. Or if you met someone new and you're all, you know, in love, butterflies. Spirit says, uh-uh, you just need to move on. Stop holding on to it. Let it go. Cut it off immediately. Because I have something better waiting for you. What you've been asking for, what you want, that's what's waiting for you. It's not with this person that's in jail. It's not with this new person over here who's trying to control you. It's coming. All you have to do is wait and be patient. 
your blessing is on the way. So group B, these are your messages. I hope they resonate. Stay true with, to thyself and real with thyself. Grow with me as I grow with you. Everyone stay blessed.